Coming up on New England Ski Journal, we're in the White Mountains of New Hampshire with a look at seven resorts enjoying the return of a full winter of skiing and fun. In the winter, the views of Mount Washington are spectacular. Some of the best come from the many ski resorts surrounding the mountain. We're going to take a trip around the region to show you all the winter fun waiting for you. But first, we need a good breakfast at 27 North in North Conway. I've known Andrea from Delaney's, and when she opened this place, we definitely um, made it a point to come and visit. Love the menu, it's very eclectic. I really like it. I got Oreo pancakes. And you've got Barney pancakes. These Fruity are pebble. It's a and real Oreos. Oreos. Bacon is also good. I love coming to 27 North because it's right next to the mountains, it's right next to the train across the street, and it's by the amazing M&D Playhouse. And let me tell you, the food here, you can't beat it. I like the home fries, yeah. My favorite is the Bloody Mary. They have the best Bloody Marys in the valley. Hands down. We love the tots. And the tots, obviously. <laughs> I think these pancakes are really good and the French toast. Steak's good. Ask for it rare. It's nice. <laughs> nice. Tots are good. Drinks are good. <laughs> the staff is awesome. It's a great atmosphere. You see other locals here. And for a breakfast place, they're not all about turning over tables. Like they allow you to sit and enjoy your breakfast without ever feeling rushed. If you're in the area, definitely check it out. The vibe is amazing. The food is delicious every time. Come, 27 North's the best. And it's less than a mile to Cranmore Mountain Resort. Cranmore is ground zero for many skiing families in the Mount Washington Valley and a great place for organized lessons. In addition to great skiing, Cranmore features a snow tubing park and a year-round adventure park. Looking for a smaller, family-owned resort with short lift lines? Black Mountain in Jackson, New Hampshire is it. With its south-facing trails, you will also get plenty of sun. Black has been creating memories for skiers since 1935 and has a rich history, including one of the first snowmaking systems in New England. Stay with us on New England Ski Journal as we continue our trek around Mount Washington Valley with skiing from both Atatash and Wildcat when we return. New England Ski Journal's Base Camp Podcast is the weekly podcast on the New England ski scene and beyond. Be sure to download Base Camp wherever you get your podcasts or at skijournal.com. Hi everyone, Ray Stenson here at Country Ski and Sport and today we're going to be talking about what's new in the world of boots. The most important thing for shopping for boots is going to a boot professional and being fit for a pair of ski boots. So this boot here that we're going to talk about today is a Nordica Sport Machine. This particular one is women's but they make this model in men's as well. Basically the difference between a men's boot and a woman's boot is going to be its lower cuff. Men's boots are going to have a higher cuff because men are typically taller. The benefit of this sport machine boot is for the beginner to intermediate skier. This boot's going to provide comfort as well as performance for them to advance. The benefit of having a low flexing boot is it's going to allow the skier to get in and out of their turn easier to help with more control. 
Uh, some of the advantages to this boot are gonna be the power strap, the micro adjustable buckles right here, and it's wider profile. So the next boot that we're gonna be talking today is the Mindbender 100 from K2. This boot may look a little bit different than others because it is, it's designed for uphill hiking and touring. In the past 10 years, uphill hiking and touring has become more popular because the skier may wanna get up to the top of the mountain and get fresh tracks before the mountain opens or might like to do some moonlight skiing. So the benefits to this boot, whether or not you're using it for touring or just everyday skiing, is it's super lightweight design and it's hike feature. The third boot today is a boot from Lang. It's a woman's specific boot, the LX95HV. The benefit of this particular boot is it's a wider fitting boot for the advanced level woman skier. Some of the features of this boot are gonna be it's grip walk design for easier getting to and from the mountain. It's micro adjustable buckles to adjust the fine tune the fit. And for this power strap here to really get the cuff against your shin. My number one advice for someone that's looking for new ski boots is to go see a ski shop professional. So come down to Country Ski and Sport where one of our boot fitters will make sure you get in the right boot. We're located in Hanson, Quincy, and Westwood, Massachusetts. From North Conway to the bottom of the Mount Washington Auto Road is about a 30 minute drive, but it's worth it for a day at the Great Glen Trails Outdoor Center. This is a really special location, and anyone who comes to recreate here can feel that. We have one of the best views of the Northern Presidentials probably in the whole state. We have some beautiful birch glades and hemlock forests as you either snowshoe or cross-country ski. This location is just unparalleled. Mount Washington Auto Road is the oldest man-made tourist attraction in the United States. It was opened in 1861, and Great Glen Trails was created in the late 1990s as part of the package to develop this whole region as an outdoor destination. For cross-country skiing, we have one of the most meticulously maintained trail networks around 27 kilometers of perfectly groomed trails for both skate and classic skiing. The Tubing Hill is perfect for anyone and requires absolutely no skill whatsoever. Families come here, kids between the ages of two and 82. Everybody smiles on the Tubing Hill. Snow Coach is a really unique experience. It's a passenger vehicle that we've outfitted with these like snow tracks and it enables us to take folks up about an hour and a half tour that goes up to Treeline on the Mount Washington Auto Road. It's warm, it's heated, you can learn about the history of the Auto Road, what makes Mount Washington so unique, and also perhaps get to experience some of this amazing weather that we get on Mount Washington. We are blessed to be able to live in this community and work here because there's so much access to outdoors activities. You can find us at greatglentrails.com. Of course, you can't talk about the Mount Washington Auto Road and Great Glen Trails Outdoor Center anymore without talking about our newest part of this campus, if you will, the Glen House Hotel. The same families that own the Auto Road and Great Glen Trails also own the Glen House. As guests of the hotel, many of the features, use of the trails we pay for. The hotel features 68 guest rooms. The rooms on the back side of the hotel are premium rooms and all have the views. The Notch Grill is comfort food with a twist. We're very proud of our bartending team. They have a really interesting and diverse menu. The hotel is all about sustainability. We have geothermal heating and cooling, so our electric bill at this point is really quite small compared to a hotel of our size. Go to our website, which is theglenhouse.com. You're going to find packaging there for a whole variety of amenities. Now that we have lodging on property, it really makes this destination a place to come in all seasons. Find us, come play. It is a spectacular location. It is also right down the road to one of the most scenic and most challenging mountains in New Hampshire. Wildcat Mountain in Pinkham Notch offers terrain for all abilities 
a rustic hardcore vibe, and some of the best snow in New Hampshire. The Wildcat Express Quad will get you to the top in under seven minutes, where you will be blown away by the views of Mount Washington, as well as the varied trails down. Over in Bartlett, New Hampshire is Atatash Mountain Resort. Like Wildcat, Atatash is owned by Vail Resorts and they pay special attention to snowmaking and grooming. Atatash consists of two mountains as Bear Peak was developed in the 90s. Both mountains have high-speed quads going from base to summit. Coming up on New England Ski Journal, New Hampshire's largest resort, Bretton Woods, with amazing views of both Mount Washington and the Mount Washington Hotel. New England Ski Journal is your complete source for skiing and the outdoors in New England. With some of the best writers and photography in the industry, New England Ski Journal will inform and inspire you with insight and advice on the ski and outdoor scene like no one else. From special destinations, resorts, lodging, gear, backcountry gems, the opera scene, as well as summer and fall experiences, New England Ski Journal is your go-to source for guide and adventure. Log on to skijournal.com forward slash subscribe to start your ski and outdoor experience today. If you're looking for daily content on the New England ski and outdoor scene, skijournal.com has you covered. Delivering insider information with their expert lineup of ski and outdoor journalists in the industry. Looking for your next ski experience? Check out all of our New England Ski Journal episodes at skijournal.com as we visit some of the best ski resorts and destinations in the region. Welcome back. When enjoying all of the outdoor fun in the Mount Washington Valley, don't forget to fill your backpack with plenty of snacks. Welcome to the North Conway House of Jerky. Right next door, we have the North Conway Olive Oil Company. So you can come in and shop at either store. Probably have about 50 or 60 different flavors of jerky. The quality is awesome. The ingredients are fantastic. You don't have all these sweeteners and MSG that you have in some of the gas station brands. We have vegan, we have beef, turkey. We've even got the really hot stuff like ghost pepper, Carolina Reaper, for those people that really want it hot. We have some Western, which is a cross between black pepper and teriyaki, all kinds of briskets, biltong, which is South African jerky. We got a brand new lamb jerky, some brand new gluten-free stick bites that we like. And then we've got the exotics. Camel, kangaroo, whiskey rabbit, wild boar, python. Not only is it crazy, but the real secret in the place is that it's super fresh. High quality, a lot of protein, just a perfect thing to put in your backpack. You come in here, you can have lunch, get some jerky, and then go right on to your ski destination. It's right nearby. Not only is jerky a big part of our business here, but you gotta stop next door. We have 85 different flavors of olive oil and vinegars. Here's our number one seller here, Tuscan Herb Olive Oil. It goes on anything, any roasted vegetable, roasted potatoes, spaghetti squash, avocado toast, put it in your cheeseburger patties. And the cool thing about Tuscan Herb, this is your bread dipper. Just add Parmesan cheese, red pepper flake. Me personally, I like to put it with an 18-year-old balsamic. Just a little dab in there, give it a little sweetness, it's unbelievable. One oil, large base, put it with 12 different vinegars. You can use it seven days a week, all kinds of different meals. We are on the web at NorthConwayHouseOfJerky.com. We do have the two locations. We're here in the village. We're also located down at the outlet stores. We promise you it'll be the experience of a lifetime. 
It's New Hampshire's largest ski resort, and Bretton Woods continues to grow each year with plenty of room to ski, four high-speed quads, and an eight-passenger gondola. We're too young to talk about forever, talk about the weather, to know any better. I just want to laugh until I can't breathe. Midnight moonlight dancing, never get enough sleep. The historic Mount Washington Hotel is part of the resort and has recently undergone some renovations to make it the perfect spot for your ski getaway. done yet visiting some of the many ski resorts of New Hampshire. We will have looks at both Loon and Cannon when we return on New England Ski Journal. Welcome back. We are skiing at many of the resorts in the White Mountains and if you are in need of a romantic retreat, the Adair Inn in Bethlehem, New Hampshire is waiting for you. This home was built in 1927 by uh, Frank Hogan, who is the father of Dorothea Dareguider. He left it to her as a wedding gift. Frank Hogan was a famous U.S. trials lawyer, as was Dorothy's husband. Many U.S. presidents, Supreme Court justices, and other political figures personally would come and stay here. In 1991, it became an inn. There's 11 rooms, two of which have queen-size beds. The other nine rooms have king-size beds and fireplaces. Out of the three tiers of rooms here, we have three suites which are pet friendly. We also have two houses on the estate that we rent that are pet friendly as well. Ultimately, we can sleep up to about 40 guests here. When you walk in here, you kind of feel like you're stepping back in time. And our rooms really say that. Even if there's a jetted spa jacuzzi in your room, you still feel like you're living in the 20s. You step back in time as soon as you sit down and feel the vibe of the house. In our dining room, you'll find authentic New England cuisine with daily specials that might go outside the box. In our granite room, which is all hand-carved granite, there's an original Brooks pool table from Boston, a whole set of games, a huge hearth fireplace, and just a really cozy spatial area, kind of like speakeasy-ish. I also love our library pub. Every book is first edition and it's a wonderful place to relax and have a cocktail. We're located just above the notch in the White Mountains off of exit 40. We're so close to Cannon, as well as the skiing at Bretton Woods. You can spend the day here hiking on our eight and a half miles of trails, bird watching, snowshoeing, cross country skiing. In this winter, right through spring, we've been doing a two for one. It's a great lodging package where any midweek day, you get your second day for free. You can also stay a Friday and Saturday and choose Thursday or Sunday for free as well. This really is a tremendous home away from home and a wonderful place to visit any time of year. You can reach any of us anytime at adarin.com. We're available seven days a week. If you live in or around the Boston area, it doesn't get much easier to get to Loon Mountain. Straight up Route 93 for exciting winter fun. In 2021, Loon became the first resort in New England to install an eight-seat chairlift 
and the Kankamangas 8 even comes with heated seats. Go further up Route 93 to Franconia Notch and you will run straight into Cannon Mountain. Cannon is recognized as one of the best values in the East by the readers of Ski Magazine. Cannon has both the longest vertical drop and the highest summit elevation in New Hampshire, and the skiing and scenery are also some of the best. That concludes our look at the ski resorts of New Hampshire. We will see you next time on New England Ski Journal.